What's up guys? How are you doing today? It's Angry Role Player, Alien the Morning Division guys. Yesterday there was a huge announcement uh in the StarCraft scene and in the in, in uh, Blizzard Universe. Basically the remastered version of Star StarCraft has been announced and I'm kind of really hyped about that because they were hiring people for classic remastering of uh, the older games for the last two years and at least now we know why they wanted to do this they've been working on remasters obviously and this is the first announcement that happened yesterday when Mike Morahim announced StarCraft HD remastered in South Korea guys let's watch this for information please Anyang Haseo On behalf of all of us at Blizzard, we're very happy to be here today for a very special celebration. At the end of this week, we'll mark the 19th anniversary of the release of StarCraft. If StarCraft was a Korean baby in 1998, the baby would be considered 20 years old now. StarCraft has always enjoyed a very special relationship with Korea. We at Blizzard are very grateful for the way our game has been embraced here and we're proud of the role that StarCraft has pay played in the establishment of esports as we know it today. That is something that could only have happened here in the mecca of esports. And we thank all of you for being part of it. We do have something to share with regard to StarCraft Brood War. Later this week, we will be patching the game to version 118. This update will include new features and bug fixes, including an official observer mode, improved anti-cheat measures, better compatibility with modern operating systems, and more. I also want to take this opportunity like to recognize the work really like of the engineers who helped create the Brood War community known as FISH. Them, updating them for the model as many of you know, That's FISH crazy. has been the home to many of the most dedicated and competitive Brood War players. Starting with patch 118 and going forward, the FISH server and community will be natively supported as a I mean, gateway in StarCraft. The update the games after 20 and years. lastly, in patch 118, I'm very pleased to announce that this update will make StarCraft and Brood War completely free. Anyone will be able to download and play now. StarCraft for That's free crazy. following 118, has been 19 following the 118 Star release Star later this week. This, okay, and they pulled it from now there is one store. more thing that I have to share with you today. Let's roll the video. Time to start off in the 90s, guys. We had terrible fucking internet here, so we used to play on the world. It's mostly computers because we couldn't play online. We played a lot in the computer club and used to pay money to go to pay. This looks fantastic. Look at this sharpness for the section. And also, I uh, uh, read the interview with the something that is basically this is the same game, guys. This is not some kind of remake. It's an absolutely the same game. We hope that you're as excited about StarCraft Remastered as we are. We know that fans in Korea have enjoyed StarCraft for almost the last 20 years. We wanted to show our appreciation to this amazing community with StarCraft Remastered. We hope you will enjoy playing for the next 20 years and beyond. StarCraft Remastered is coming this summer. Thank you, and you can visit www.starcraft.com 
for more information. Please enjoy the rest of the celebration. So that's fucking awesome, guys. And uh, I recommend you go to StarCraft.com and check what's in there. Basically, there's a lot of remastered pictures, videos, and all of that stuff. That's crazy, crazy. You know, I'm a, I was been a, I've been a big StarCraft fan back in the day. Big StarCraft fan, and we played a lot with my friend. Uh, we played against computers. I finished, of course, campaign for each race. It has been absolutely awesome. And even though you know I'm not very hyped for this, uh, like I, I don't think I will be replaying this uh, over again simply for the graphics. But still, uh, the understanding of this that they actually remastered this old game. Not only this is crazy after 20 years, but also. Uh, the, some people are really hyped and are thinking that Diablo 2 may be getting a remaster as well. Like there is a thread here somewhere, like possibility of Diablo 2 remastered. And people really believe that a uh, remaster might happen of Diablo 2. I think that this is not gonna happen because <clears throat> Diablo 2 uh, is not like so easy to remaster like the starcraft starcraft is you know uh, a, an editor made game so you can edit your own uh create your own maps in the editor and all this it's kind of pretty you can build your own stuff it's so much easier for them to remaster starcraft than diablo 2 and for diablo 1 i'm not uh, I, I don't think that it's worth it spending time on remastering diablo 1 I mean, uh, it, this game has no replay value at all. Like you bet hell, uh, and there's there's nothing to do. There's no end game in Diablo One. Like in Starcraft, you can play for eternity. That's why people play Starcraft. As Star in Diablo One, there's no replay value, unfortunately. And even though Diablo One is my all-time favorite game, and I've spent enormous amount of time in, uh, in Diablo One in the 90s. But I, I don't think it will be remastered. And Diablo 2, this is questionable, but I don't think it's worth it for Blizzard. I mean, not many people will be playing Diablo 2. Mm, I think it will be, if it will be remastered. I don't think it's entirely worth it. Like, they better spend some time and uh, create Diablo 4 for us instead of remastering Diablo 2. So, <clears throat> that's what I think, guys. And I also I recommend you going to the StarCraft site, StarCraft.com and checking all these, you know, these new pictures and all this stuff. It's fucking awesome, absolutely. And these pictures are fucking incredible. I'm really impressed with the quality they did with the, the, the remaster. You know, I recently wanted to play some Diablo 2 and StarCraft and uh, I just couldn't handle the graphics out there. Uh, and uh, I know I'm not very like the, the graphic guy who plays for the graphics, but indeed the graphics were very very outdated. This game is 20 years old guys, so they basically needed a remaster to have it uh, value raised and to be replayable and uh, especially this is what will also will be 4K resolution, 4K resolution, that's crazy guys. And it uh, will support wide screens and all that shit. But the most important thing is that the gameplay itself will be preserved 100%. It's absolutely the same gameplay like it was before. Uh, they didn't you know, change any aspects of the original game. Like in the StarCraft 2 you can select infinite amount of units. In Diablo, in the original StarCraft you need to have you know, kind of groups. And it will be remain the same. So basically, there's no changes to gameplay. That's why the core mechanics of Starcraft is unchanged. That's why it's so unique. So uh, this is it, guys. And let me know in the comment section if you you will be hyped for the Diablo 2 remaster or Diablo 1 remaster. And will you be playing Starcraft remaster as well? Uh, once it released and it will be released earlier this week with a free download of patch 1.18 and it's really crazy 
uh, like I said earlier, they were still selling StarCraft Anthology for $20 on their store. Now they will be free. So that's a pretty insane move. Thanks for watching, guys. See you soon and let me know what you think about it.